Um, question 15, you have a 50 kg man weighing himself right uh, at the pole versus at the equator. So what's the difference between the two reading? So let's draw a free body diagram. Oh, I already drawn the weight. Um, at the equator, uh, sorry, at the poles, right, the person is not performing any circular motion. So the normal contact force, right, is equals to the weight, uh, purely, yeah. But at the equator, right, because this person is performing circular motion together with Earth's rotation, yeah. So there's actually, right, a small acceleration here, the centripetal acceleration. So what is the normal contact force? Normal contact force, right, in this case, has to be smaller than mg, so that there will be a net force, okay? So mg minus n equals to mac. Yeah, so with that, right, you can see, right, that the, um, let me write out the equation, oh, at equator, mg minus n equals to uh, mac. Hence, right, this amount is the difference in the reading yeah because at the pole the normal contact force is just equals to mg so this is what we are trying to solve for so we have 50 uh ac is r omega square so you have right 6.4 times 10 to the power of 6 times uh 4 pi square over is 6 400 square okay Uh, with that, right, you calculate, uh, it should work out to be this entire term, right, um, is around 0 0.03, okay? So, times 50, that will give you around 1 point something Newton, okay? I don't want to use, I'm lazy to even take a calculator, so answer is C.